Uh, my name is Chris Fratta. Uh, I am the sales manager and a loan officer here for the Baltimore branch of Hometown Lenders. Uh, I've been in the industry, it'll be 28 years in August. Um, so it's been nearly three decades. And uh, I came aboard on Hometown Lenders back in October of 2020. I was just finishing up college and I was actually selling cars to help pay for school. And I had sold a car to a vice president of a small local bank. And he had asked me what my plans were post-college. And I said, well, I'd like to get into a sales job, I'd like to get into in the business. And he introduced me to a gentleman who owned a small mortgage company. And uh, he and I sat down and we decided it was gonna be a pretty good fit for his company and for myself. So it was one of those things where I showed up the first day of work, they said, here's your desk, and then he walked away. That was it. But as I learned the business, as I started to educate myself about what it was I was supposed to do and the impact that I could have on other future homeowners, you know, it became a job that um, it turned into a career. It turned into to an effort to pr promote homeownership, to provide people that slice of the American pie. Every day when, you, when, when we go to work, you know, we're, we're dealing with different clients, different scenarios, but the, the goal is always the same, to get them into their home, to get their family safe and secure, and that's what kind of drives us every single day. So homeownership is a special, special thing. You know, I think every time we see a client who purchases their first home or, or even that, that, that second, third home, you know, there's a sense of relief they have when they're walking out of settlement. Uh, I was fortunate that I bought my first house when I was 22. And the thing about that, buying your first house at that young, I was still in college. I didn't have an, a clue of what was involved. I didn't know what a PITI payment was. I didn't understand what an APR was. It was total confusion. So when I got into this industry, the one thing that I, I really make sure that is, is I don't forget how I felt when I bought that first house. And I don't forget that I do this 100 plus times a year, but the average client might do it four times in their life. So we try, try and treat every single client as if this is their first home. My job is to make sure that they understand the process, they understand the risks that are involved with buying a home, because you have to know those risks to make sure that you don't step into those potholes. And just make sure that their financial picture today is gonna be secured tomorrow. And, and that's kind of what drives me, is never ever forgetting that what we do serves a purpose in our community, but we have to remember that not, the community doesn't quite understand what they're doing. And it's our job to educate them and help them and get as many people into homes as, as possible. Learn, learn the business, stay on top of, of the industry. We change constantly in this industry. You know, guidelines change rapidly, programs come and go. And what I would say to myself, you know, 28 years ago was approach it as if it's your career and not a job. A job is temporary, but a career creates so many other opportunities for yourself, for your family, and for others. And so when you're doing that, it's important that you understand what you're doing. You understand what are the driving principles of your industry. You understand how mortgages work and how those mortgages can benefit the community. And you know, whether it's myself 28 years ago or for somebody new coming in, that's the one thing I'm gonna hammer home is understand what we're doing, stay on top of the, the, the information, get ahead of the curve, and you should be able to explain what you do to a five-year-old um, if you understand it that well. The Mortgage Analyst Program is an opportunity. It's an opportunity to understand this business and create a career and create a life for yourself. I think the benefit of this Mortgage Analyst position and program, which is gonna differentiate ourselves from all the other mortgage companies in this, in this industry, is the fact that we are going to train these individuals to become mortgage professionals. We are notoriously poor in this industry for, for not training individuals. We have a pretty high turnover rate. So we're gonna put these folks into the program. They're gonna to learn together in like a cohort situation. They're gonna have mentorship from us. You know, some of us have been in the business almost 30 years, some 10 years, but not only from us, but they're also gonna be able to learn from each other. So it's gonna be almost as if it's a graduate program like in college. So they're gonna bounce ideas off of each other. They're gonna share them with us. We're gonna give our experiences. And it's just gonna give them that foundation that they can have to build their career and progress in this industry with some knowledge versus just getting up every day and, and showing up in an office. Working for the hometown family is coming from 
being in this industry as long as I've been in and, and working for big, big corporations, you lose that one-on-one -on -one touch. You just become a cog. One thing about hometown lenders that really has kind of, um, that I've learned to love in, in the last even just five months that I've been here compared to where I was in the 20 some years prior was everybody has a voice in what we're doing. You know, everybody can reach out to the, to the upper level of corporate and say, you know, maybe we should do this, or maybe we should tweak it this way, or, or you know what, I think maybe if we look at this option, we may see a better result over here. And it's not just a suggestion box. I mean, these are things that, that corporate implements. They, they take our words seriously. And coming from where we came from, um, it's nice to know that you are not just appreciated for your numbers, but you're appreciated for your opinion, you're appreciated for your experience, and that experience helps make that company stronger as we move forward. We impact the community because our number one effort and our number one goal is to promote home ownership. We understand that there are some underserved communities that don't have the opportunities to get their slice of the American pie. We want to work with folks who you know, want to purchase a home. And they may not be able to do it today, but we're going to work with them. We're going to coach them along. We're going to show them the roadmap to get to that point. You know, and you know, what we do in this industry is important. But what we do is putting money back into the economy. It's pushing that, that, that position forward to allow that, that next person to be able to purchase that home and create a, you know, purchase the house which then creates a home for their family. So I think that's what we are, we're very community minded. One thing that really attracted me to hometown lenders, we focus on a, on a global scale as well too. Um, you know, we have a platform called Firefly. You know, Billy Taylor, who's the CEO of hometown lenders is so passionate about um, where he's, he's setting up you know, fresh water in villages in third world countries. He's, he's bringing those, those opportunities that extend beyond, you know, our country, you know, because uh, everybody should have a place that they go home to every evening and it's safe, it's comfortable and it's secure. And, and that's what we want to do at, at the local level. And that's what we want to do on the, on the global level as well. My name is Chris Fratta. This is Hometown Approved.